it does load it. Handle it. Pokey. Normal. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, nothing. Don't be do be do be do be do. So yeah, point, click, get things, and Harvey gives us hints with I, I believe. Oh no, it's an inventory. Um, look. This is my old buddy Harvey. That doesn't work that way. Mm. Uh. Um, hello? Hello, Edna. What's up? What is this place? I have no idea, but I want to get out of here. Me too. It seems to be some kind of asylum. This must be a misunderstanding. Really should point out, it seems like it's for kids. It's fucking not. Who the heck are you? Um, what? You can speak? I'm your buddy, Harvey. It's a shame you don't recognize me. I'll help you get out of here and try to restore your memory. How's it going, Harvey? How's it going, dude? I'd be much better if we were out of here already. I'll go and have a look around then. Maybe I can find a way out of here. Doesn't look half bad to have upholstery on the walls. Use. Ha! <laughs> I wonder what the padding is for. Sound insulation, I guess. You mean no one can hear us in here? It's still worth a try. Will you cut it out in there? Bite my shite. Doesn't look half bad to have a post. Are you the sound absorbing type of padding? I'll take that as a yes. I can't reach between the gaps with my fingers. Table. Talk to the table. Hold it, table. Good boy. There not been a pun. Give me a chair. Not without consulting my interior decorator. What? How do you feel about this chair, Harvey? It's hiding something. <laughs> you think so? It looks so harmless. That's just a cover, believe me. Hey, Harvey, do you want to play emergency room? Only if I get to play the surgeon. In that case, I'll give it a pass. Bars. Hello? Hello? Can anybody hear me? What do you want? I want out of here. Forget it! What kind of way is that to treat a guest? We won't give up that easily, will we? Hmm. Hey! Hello! Don't make so much noise in there! What do you want? Jesus fucking butt fucking 
Boh. The most annoying patient I've ever had to guard. Patient? Am I sick then? I certainly don't feel sick. Listen, sweetie, you're in a room with padded walls. Why don't you try to figure it out for yourself? Where am I? Honey, if I answered that question every time one of you loonies asked me, I wouldn't even have time to go to the bathroom anymore. <laughs> But you think say all that? I'm not paid for talking. Anything else? Not paid for talking? Then fuck off then. Cunt. Why can't I remember anything? I'm not going to explain that to you yet again. Only so you can forget it during your next treatment again. I'm not insane. Isn't that so, Harvey? Right. She isn't insane. Do you hear? Harvey agrees. <laughs> You really are an odd couple. The both of you. <laughs> what is that laughing up here? How <laughs> Why is it so hot in here? That might be due to the air conditioner being turned off. What air conditioner? There is no air conditioner in here. <laughs> That's why it's turned off then. Do you think the doctor is stupid enough? To have an exposed ventilation shaft in your cell? <laughs> the air conditioner is hidden behind the padding, of course. Is that so? An air conditioner behind the padding? That does make much more sense, of course. But notice how skillfully you're guarding this door. Try. Ah, you notice that, eh? Oh, so you might have also noticed work. that I have my own technique. I developed it at the last tournament. Yep. You're an athlete? Must be joking. Really? So you're a famous athlete? Do you play on a team or something? Oh, <laughs> I... Well, I play golf. Mini golf. Yep. I bet Mommy bought the club for you. Mini golf. I'm getting all dizzy. Could you tell me, could you let me out and show me some of your golf skills? Could you tell me something else? Well, excuse me for a moment. My rabbit is trying to tell me something. Mini golf? I'm getting all dizzy. And with good reason, sweetheart. You know what? I'll turn on the AC for you. You can cool off a bit that way. So we must head. Oh. Okay. That's that then. Um. Hmm. Is there one of these? Wait, Harvey, what you said about? Hello, Harvey. Hello, Edna. What's up? Oh, nothing. Forget it. Oh, I do so love these old. Vague, weird ass fucking games. Hold on, let me just double, triple check something. Fucking, you said about Hello, it. Hello, Edna. What's up? Right. Do be do. Wait, what? Let's see how detachable this chair leg really is. Nobody said anybody was detachable, but apparently it is. Okay. I've detached the leg. Mayhem! Yippee! <laughs> Sound. Alright. Let me use chair leg on. And where would that air duct be? Over here? In the big bit? Oh. That didn't do much now, did it? If only I had something pointy. That didn't do much now, did it? If only I had something pointy. Hmm. But 
out of a table? What? Maybe I'll get a bigger one. Oops. I broke my chair leg. Yeah, baby. Let's trash the whole place. What did that do though? Oh, it's been too long. I wonder what the padding is for. Sound insulation, I guess. You mean no one can hear us in here? I know, it's we're done with that. We Say hello, Chairman. Hello? Say something. Oh, I tried to talk to oh, no. it. Don't. I've killed my friend, Chairman Chairleg. <laughs> um, can we use it now? There we go. I've done enough slashing for now. I can't reach between the gaps with my fingers. You cut a hole, why don't you fool? I've created a piece of art. But yeah, I... Right. I've done enough slashing for now. Hmm. Ah, right, I see. Cut one will probably have a... sort of whooshing behind it if it's the one that's got the... aircon, I'm assuming. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Game, fuck you, seriously, yes, sir. I should really just use a guide, but I don't want to, because it's... Half of this game's charm is just working out the stupid shit it went into. times to get them. Uh, let's there seems it. to be a passage behind this particular cushion. Okay. Can we I Use can't it? get any further with my bare hands. Hmm. Can I slash more? Aha. Why two then? Why two? Ah. It's a flathead chair leg, but a Phillips screw head. <laughs> I can't unscrew it without some kind of tool. Huh. You used to know how way back when. What do you mean? You used to be able to loosen screws with no tool before. That's what I mean. Back for now? Nope. How does one back? I want to back. It's screwed on tight. All right, Harvey. Do do you have a thing to say? Do I speak to you? Hello, Harvey. Hello, Edna. What's up? Back what now. do you mean by all this back then nonsense? Well, you used to be able to pull off a pretty cool trick. Could I juggle burning chainsaws? Not exactly that, but a couple of stupid screws would never have been an obstacle for you. I must have been an extra laid-back kid. What else do you know? Um, that yeah, is not known how to juggle flame and chainsaws made you lazy kid. I'm a projection of your subconscious. Nobody's perfect. I can give your memory a boost, but you'll have to show me things that remind you of your childhood. Like the screws? Exactamundo! And then? Then I'll tempo morph us to the past! Cool! Normal! Do I do so? Look at, talk to, take, use, chair. I can't unscrew it without. Shall bed now. What do you. you I hate great! Oh, wait, I fucking course play. Right, uh. We're gonna use you. Only you. I'm ready, Harvey. Shall I tempo morph you to the past now? <laughs> I don't know what any of those words mean, but uh, let's just explain yeah. that to them. Tempo morph me to the past. As you wish. Hold on. 
I'm going to use it as synonymous for trip balls to the past. Bunny. This is the past? It looks like our old basement at least. And look at me. I'm young. We've jumped back about ten years. Don't I have to be careful now that I don't run over my own grandpa or something? No more than usual. We're just observing your memory here. Ah, I see. So I don't have to be careful in case I step on some dinosaur eggs. Not if you can find any. I know what day this is. My father locked me up in the basement because I teased a neighbor's boy. His name was Albert or... Alfred. Alfred Marcel. Alfred Marcel? Like in Dr. Marcel? Oh no. You better believe it. He's the son of the doctor in charge of the asylum. Whoa. But Exposition. We're here to teach you the art of loosening screws without a tool. Right you know then? Hmm. I have to get my bearings first. I'll go first if you don't mind. We can take turns, okay? Okay. Why am I dropping friends? Game, why you do this? Do not do this to me. I do not like the dropping of friend. Hmm. I am now on Harvey. It's a solid rake with a long handle. Hmm. Edna is by far the most interesting human being in the world. How are you, Edna? I'm asking myself why you brought me here. Didn't you want to teach me how I can loosen screws? We'll get right to it. Okay, um... It's a solid... I wonder if Edna can... Yes, well, let me control the Edna. How are you, Edna? I didn't... Tick, 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 tick. Uh, wait, hold on. Rake, use on Edna. Can you reach the window with a rake? Hmm, this almost sounds like it could work. I could give it a try, Nani. if you let me. Okay, right. Uh, oh, there's a button. Okay. This is already very different. Well, similar enough, but it's different enough also from the original experience. It was like 2009 or something. Uh, give me that. Hmm. It wanted me to reach the windows, didn't it? Do -do -do. That doesn't work that way. Shut up, you fool. It's already open. Okay, we'll use it then. I can't reach it. It seems to be a lovely day today. Hello? Is anybody out there? Hmm. Hello? Right. What about I just fucking want for you outside? Does that work? Um, Edna? Will you help me up there? Just for a second? Yeah, I think I can manage. Oh, we're just, we're just here now, okay. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing there. You can see that. So we flew out the door. This leads back. Maybe Edna knows how I can get through. Do you still have? Yeah, I do. I just... Um... Yeah. Okay, right. Uh, collect Maybe topic. Edna knows how I can get through there. So does this let me use this as an active topic with Edna? Edna, it... Edna, you... Hmm. Um... Yeah. Right, let me back it up. Rainwater. Oh. oh, there's somebody sitting there. The guy on the left is Mattis, Edna's father. But on the right, 
Hey, isn't that Alfred Marcel? That's the son of Dr. Marcel, the head of the asylum. Exposition. I was with him a lot back then. But why is he sitting here eating ice cream with Mattis when Edna's locked inside? I don't get it. Oh, comic book. <sighs> Molly develops new rhymes. Chaos phonetics researchers from the big words of the big word institute applied big words have my uh, oh was actual linguistics so it was a bit big words see I'm right occasionally figgity figgity bigity shiggity miggity poetry three new important combinations to whatever and thing chestnut thief I don't I don't I don't care this says that you're allowed to rhyme easel with brush. Yippee! That oversight was long overdue. <laughs> it says that the chestnut bird will have to watch just a second. This is interesting. It says he escaped by using a chewed up <laughs> toenail. Hmm. In Flint, Michigan, a left handed person was stabbed with a right handed pair of scissors. Very strange. Mighty oh ho. So, yep, yeah, no, I don't want to look at it. I want to talk to Edna. Edna used to. Edna is by. Talk, talk, talk to the Edna. Alright, okay, I'll do, do that. Mega Jim Fig. Edna, you. Shut it. Edna, you. Shut it. Edna is by. F talk. Do you still. Yeah, I. I, I don't want. Interesting. The screws keep this plate in place. I remember. It's all coming back to me. Edna was able to loosen the screws. All I have to figure out now is exactly how she did it. This is the last piece in the... I can see nobody there and the key... Okay, let me, let me out. Let me out. Okay, cool. Screws. I'm gonna have to fucking swap the- oh, what? Why? Locked. What else could it be? What? Hmm. So the only- the only control I have is to press I, left click and right click. Um, tab does note. Escape just opens my menu. Control, alt, nothing. Oh, well, that's much more handy. Try it out. Can oil dry out? Yucky, 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 yucky. I like marmalade. Were you not granted an honorable end? Is there anybody in there? Nope, I'm completely empty. Oh. Empty. Right. If you rescue Rust, a jar full of rusty mail. Doesn't my father keep anything useful here? Hmm. Firewood? It's gonna be a long stream, man. <laughs> right. Harvey, how does one interact with a Harvey if one is but a humble brine? The good old furnace. Right, no. The screws are keeping it. Okay. With my bare head. Okay, right. With my. I, I know what I want to get to happen here, right? It's, it's want me to. 
suggest to How Edmund. Are you, Ed? I'm asking my student. You we'll get. Do I need to do something with this, right? So. This is the last piece in the. Okay. Yeah. Great. <laughs> Edna is. This is the last. Maybe Edna knows how I can. Hmm. I'm basically trying to copy what happened in that newspaper article with the fucking toenails. Hmm. Edna is by far the most. Hey Edna, I found some screws. I know now. You have to loosen these screws to get out of here. That doesn't really help as much, does it? Now we've got the same problem as the one in the prison. All right. I'll have another look around. I promise you I'll get us out of here. Edna, you... Hmm. Well, what then about... There's a door. Do you have any idea? I don't think... How would you... Right. I'd better keep... Um, yeah. Right, I think maybe I didn't do enough with this. Son, hello. It says that the chestnut will have to watch our chest out. It says he is. Hmm. So do I use this? The chestnut may be. Aha. I didn't collect it. Right, got you. So now she's going to chew off a fucking toenail and use it to unscrew a door. <laughs> or something. I don't know. No, we need to use Article 2, don't I? Right, uh, use one. Guess what? The chestnut burglar has escaped again! Oh no! Not again! Last time he took three trees in our street alone! Police are saying that he escaped using a chewed off toenail. Really? Hmm. A knot off toenail shouldn't be hard to come by. And now? Bulk. Let's go as Edgar. We're gonna use them. Yeah. I'm really curious to see if this is gonna work. I can't believe it! It really did work! The latch isn't held by the panel anymore. I can just open the door. This really is our old kitchen. I can't wait to go on exploring my past. No, not yet. just about to come back to me. I'm sorry. This was all I could remember. At least you learned how to loosen screws. Right. Thanks, Harvey. Where would I be without you? Oh my god. Can I chew my toenail? Gnarly <laughs> shit. That's the last thing a juicy steak gets to see before it's turned into hamburger. Oh, look at this, Harvey. A ventilator whose razor-sharp blades rotate at a deadly speed. This would fit right in with my collection of frag grenades and anti-personnel mines. What do you think? What? Shall I take it? <laughs> Harvey? I'm still thinking about it. Sure, just reach your hand right in there, hand. Look here, Harvey. I've invented the world's first chair leg sharpener ever. Cool. This would work great for vampire hunting. After we escape, we'll make millions. Yeah, okay, maybe I need to 
Right, set. Oh, I'm, I'm clicking on sell. Right. Let me talk to yonder Gargarino and see if he'll turn it off. Well, sweetheart, what is it now? I feel a little... Can you turn off? No. And with any luck, it'll make you drowsy. I'd like to know more about mini-golf. Well, who doesn't? Have I already told you that I play in the professional league? Yep. And I bet Mommy bought the club for you. Ha! <laughs> Do you think that a Babbitt and Son can be bought in just any store? Where did you get it? Did you steal it? I think this is all very exciting. Watch There's a story mind. to this game. I've never stolen anything in my life. There is a story to this game. I'm now realizing how long it's taken me to get out of the first fucking room. This might be a bit beyond my reach for a single stream, but we'll see how far I get. I'll stop up a bit late. I think my brain can take it. Where did you get it then? Is it from the junkyard? You can find the most curious things there. Do what sit on my Nobody throws out a gem like a Babbitt and Son. Uh, uh, wires. Why are wires? Whale's jawbone, that sounds badass. Did you carve it from a whale's jawbone? Ha! The whale has yet to be born! Whose jawbone can compete with the impact of a genuine Babbitt and Son? I give up. Where did you get it? My father made it for me. Jeffrey Francis von Babbitt Sr. Really? As he lay on his deathbed with shaking hands, he handed over his own Babbitt and Son Titanium 7 Iron. <laughs> his lucky club. Is that not like told me to a lot to use for money golf? So that ends conversation. I got a feeling I'm, I've got to get this clown to tell me how to make that into something hard enough to batter that way, I'm guessing. That sounds like one of those sophisticated father and son relationships. Yes. My like father how the mouth is just a, a thin line at the man. neck. He was so suave that he always wore a tuxedo. Sometimes at night, I even put on his top hat. Just to find out how it felt to be as debonair as my father. Do you mean that kind of sophisticated? Um... Well... I guess I do not. Anyway, thanks for sharing this completely useless information with me. <sighs> You're a real daddy's boy, aren't you? My father was a great man. And an incredible mini-golfer, I'm sure. Yep. That, Why then? don't you take your daddy's club and whack it across your skull? <laughs> You're mean. <laughs> My poor father. Just you wait. Let's see if you're still laughing when I turn the AC back on. Oh, well, that. Guess I'm taking the fan. Everybody needs a fan. Give me it. Able to take it with me, but I think I can pry it out of the casing if I use a bit of force. Help a lady out here, will you, Harvey? And no. all right. Ooh, can I take it? I was promised well, a ventilator. It's broken, but we could build a perfect broken helicopter from the parts. What on earth would we possibly do with the broken helicopter? Right. We'd still need somebody who could fix it. Or we could just try and find another way out of here. All the better. There must be hundreds of people out there who can fix a helicopter. Oh. <laughs> Let's go down the chut. This Edna is a real challenge, Holgor. That's Dr. Marcel's voice. It's coming from beyond this grate. Quick, maybe we can listen. Hell of a position to die in. 
What do you mean by that, Dr. Marcel? I'm at the end of my tether. It's been ten years, and she can still remember. You're afraid she might find out what really happened back then? Ha! Nobody will believe her. Who's gonna believe a loony? The daughter of a convicted murderer. So why are you worried? I'm not worried. I just hate her resistance. I can't believe what I'm hearing. My dad? A murderer? There's something rotten in the state of Denmark. Yeah. This Dr. Marcel is hiding something. As soon as we're out of here, we'll have to clear the good name of my father. And that's the fucking story of the game. Pipe. Oh, we're here now. Great. Closed. As was to be expected. Hmm. Freedom. Cut to shreds by the merciless bars of a great. There's only two things that are interactable, but... Can I nail it? Oh, they're not interactable. Yeah! That seems like a good idea. Unfortunately, the screws are on the outside, yeah. so I can't reach them. Fair enough. Hmm. Alright, Arv. We're gonna teach Mary Stoy. Maybe you can chew through the bars, Harvey. I'm afraid I can't. My teeth are made <laughs> of terry claw. Hmm. Help! I'm being held prisoner here! Where have all the heroes gone? All those knights in shining armor? Where are all those annoying do-gooders when you really need them? Freedom! Freedom! Right. Leg. We're gonna batter them. Freedom! Freedom! Would you? Freedom! No. Hmm. Yeah, I thought that was something actually happening there. Um. Yeah, well, I guess we're going back to the shoot then. Doctor Marcel and. Oh. Going to the baddies room. Doctor Marcel and who? Well, here we go again. Bonk. I'm starting to get the hang of this. The fuck, somebody is, cause I'm bloody no. Oh, so much. <laughs> a masterpiece. Give me a that. polo mallet. I want a whack folk. They have it. Oh. Trophies. One cup for a spelling bee and one for shooting clay discs. How sporting. Bonk. Doctor's a polo professional, obviously. That's definitely Dr. Marcel's distinct signature. Nope. There's no hidden safe behind it. That's not what I was thinking about it. You think you're something... Indeed, I do. I bear the name of one of the greatest scientists of our time. I suppose this was going to take its way, wouldn't it? Ugh. <sighs> Hello? Anybody in there? No. That's comforting. I used to be scared of cabinets when I was a child. <laughs> no. I used to be scared of... I can see our way to freedom clearly now. I should have finished my apprenticeship. If I had, I would surely be able to take the window out. The pen. Don't know why I, want I don't actually want to take it. Why not? Dr. Marcel has been sitting on it. Ick. It's got cootive. Now that's what I call. How much is it? <laughs> what? Nah, that's too rich for my blood. Right. Aye. Okay. Um. Bar it. Hmm. 
That's what I call a massive chair. Oh, wait, hold on, I was doing the right thing. A desk. I'm too bad there are no documents that say I'd read. Place. Source of coziness and No. Nobody has the right How about giving memories a small dent? Nah. An old foot I think I know A voice? Is that supposed to be strange? <laughs> it shows a I don't know him, but he's starting to annoy me. Wood drawer. I go in that already. Now that's what I call a how much mm -hmm. what? No, the drawer. The the drawer. A desk. Me too I go You mm. Ah, there's like a tiny wee bit. Right, drawer. I'd have to get it open first. No not the desk, the bloody drawer. A Norwegian hardwood drawer. Where do you see anything like that? Shh. The player was deeply impressed just now. I guess I need something more pointed to force it open. Well, we have this. This is point eight now. Four. Four. Hmm, I can almost get the scissors in the gap. Almost. Being the significant modifier here. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, pfft. prick. Hmm. Give me the book. I don't know why I needed that. I just wanted it. Right, what about pen? We shall. I don't think I have to mark the broken chair leg. Nobody will steal it anyway. Encyclopedia. Now, too. An alphabetical. C See also. Hmm, I can almost get almost. Right, uh, nail, use, drawer. The drawer is not screwed. The situation is, the drawer is just stuck. All right, well, but uh, use this. Right, fucking try the pen again. Or drawer, thank you. I didn't come here to tidy up. I'm really fixed on this drawer a bit. I don't even fucking need a bloody thing. I guess I need something more point. Ugh. <laughs> freaking burst your breath of fresh and. Right, what have I actually got here? I don't think it's going to be as easy as getting the bloody door, is it? Yikes! Oh, I hate that. I hate that. I hate that so much. I oh. Well, if it isn't Miss Edna, <laughs> how did you manage to get out of your cell? <laughs> God, I hate that. to go to the bathroom and got lost. Oh, come to Ulgor and I'll show you the way. The way back to your cell. Ha! Never! It's not too late to become friends. We are not your enemies, Edna. Will you stop erasing my memory and destroying my ego then? <laughs> oh. Um, no, probably not. <laughs> Great friends. What's that? Are you coming now? Ha! Never. You can't hide behind the desk forever. We'll see about that. Bonk him. But what? A 
Edna slay big animal. Ugh. Oh dear. Yes, I should get rid of him, but where to put him? Ah, I know, the cabinet. Oh, he's the oh, he's upside. That's impressive, him. <laughs> uh, I guess I just leave then. I was bothered by that drawer, but. else will take care of that. I could look that a few yards tops. I can see approximately 10 gallons of sky. Take skylight? Are you trying to tell me something? Fick Only off. someone if, if you get you open short of it, you light bulb would try that, Edna. Fick That's too high. I'm sure I can find a better exit. <laughs> So what I can think. No, it's not. That elf is one ugly critter. Ugh. Hey, you're not exactly Miss Universe yourself. Oh, that's normal. I yep. Is this an asylum for the mentally ill or Dr. Frankenstein's laboratory? There's a flashy sign on it. Drink it. Be nice good for you. color. There is some missing. Oh, Gore, is that you? Hmm. No reaction. I was so convinced. That's what I mean. But all right. The topics of conversation between me and these boxes are somewhat limited. Demographically speaking, there's an enormous disparity between our social backgrounds. I don't think wow. this game has game over, but I'm kind of worried. Looks like I still have a long way to go. Bloody f uh, use it. At the same time, not far away. Oh. Stay tuned for another mind-blowing story about people with big. <sighs> what the. Not again. Why don't we get cable here? Ah, uh, so what? I'll just go back to watching the Looney Show. That I'm picking bad. up plenty. Thank you very much. Mm. Point. Oh, great. Oh wait, do I need to make another I've already got a toenail. Do I use it on the grate? That's what happens with these, right? Charge. Yes, folks. It's time once again for Edna Conrad and her dancing toenail. Bleh. It loses some of its appeal trying to get in instead of out. Oh, I'm just back here, though. What the devil is blood the fuck? Where the frick it can I go down? Does it just let me go down? Game, 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 and come clicking around. Whoop. What? Um. Looks like I still.
you want to hear my answer? Foolishness! You'll have to get up earlier for that. Yep. Okay, Houdini. I might not know how you managed to escape, but one thing's for sure, it won't happen again. My guy is right there. Come back here at once. You'll break. Why don't you come and get me? Well, oh, isn't that cute? Our mini golf professional has a fear of heights. Coward, coward. Yeah, you just left. But eventually, you'll have to come down from there. And that's when I'll show you. Oh, right. Right. I see. That's why I can go here. And that's why I can move a little. Thank you, Digger. That doesn't work that way. <laughs> now the handle can't be pushed down anymore. What the? I don't remember doing that. That was. Hey! What's going on? I'm still in here! Oh, what the fuck? Hello! Hogor! Dr. Marcel! Somebody! Ooh. I just got the achievement. Cell free! Ew. It's the same on this side. Locked. Someone sitting there. Is that you, newbie? <laughs> to Let's be honest, see. I'm a loony on the run. Loony on the run. Right. But listen, newbie, if you've only come here to pull my leg, you might as well just take a hike. Okay, but what if I, like, shank you? Oh god. I'd rather not. Oh, He's fuck. still ignoring me. I'd rather not. He's Can has key? Maybe I could somehow Hands off! That didn't work, did it? Let's just twitch him one further. Um What about if I use Maybe I can use the broken chair leg somehow to... Hey! Keep your hands off! Let's leave this guy for a minute. Door, that's the one that's not a bit down, it's a hallway. right back into the wall that's not fair it rolls right back into the wall I wonder how I look that's strange 
I somehow thought I was blonde. All right. What? Bro, oh, 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 oh. Look, Harvey, a reflection. Oh. Why, if it isn't my evil twin from a parallel universe. I don't think he spotted us yet. Let's set a trap for him. I am getting puzzled. So. Shall I wash you, Harvey? Oh, sure. And after that, you can tie me in a pink ribbon and invite me to your tea party. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I actually need to be in here, so... I'll remember that there is a mirror. And soap. It's locked. Over this door. There's no other way down this way, so... Gumbos! Give me. Yippee! It still works. That's a heavy ass gumball. Blah. Old and inedible. Yummy. There are no darts. There is no spoon. It's more soap. Marmalade was from earlier. Oh, look at that. Ugh. Dried rhubarb compote. That's what? Ugh. Looks like it's dried, stuck to the cupboard. Ugh. Bloody, right, that's nasty. Right, coffee. Coffee, coffee. Heavenly brew. You lift my morning spirits anew. Maybe I'll just go all the way to the fucking exit. <laughs> ah, I just didn't fucking see it. Oi, door, use. If only it was that. Is it what? Hold on. It's locked. Hmm. I hate these things. Ooh, an electric room. Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. Need help from someone who knows his way around these things. How about no? What? Sweep burp. Why does he look Hello? like Beaker? Hello. Hmm. Oh. No reaction. On the phone. He's on the phone. Not connected, but okay, there it is. <coughs> Go downstairs, shall we? What is painting? I can see a little girl in a whale's belly. What? Why? It says welcome. The mat is laid out so you can read it when you go out the door. I wonder if that's supposed to be sarcasm. Yes. Some knives. Oh, great balls of fire. There's cutlery in there. Take some. Let's see. Now, what have we here? A, a knife. knife. And a fork. This series of surprises just keeps on coming. What's this? Not one spoon? Where the heck are the spoons? Oh no, there is no spoon. Mm. Right, well that's annoying. Condiments, bulletin, what's the bulletin say? You're really gonna walk all the way over that head. It says that due to a shortage of spoons, giving them back is mandatory. <sighs> It's prohibited to pass through here. I'm just visiting. Always the same witty remarks, Miss Edna. Maybe the doctor should be less thorough when erasing your memory. You always come up with the same old tricks. What else you got for me? You have a special permit. You're the newbie. 
Or no, wait. You're not really even there, right? Um... I'm really fed up with you. Alarm! Patient on the run! What's going on? What do you think? There's a Sailed patient on the it. run! Where are all the others? Aren't Babbitt and Holger around? Isn't that something you should know? I've been sitting here all day. Just I wallop know him with a mallet and leave. But obviously the whole building That's why you should be taking a knife. Same. It's just, uh, I've never dealt with an attempted escape before. <sighs> alright, alright, I'll just put her in here with the others. That must be what I'm supposed to do. There, you stay here till the doctor is back. Something seems to have gone patently wrong here. Best jigsaw, then I think. Drogo jug and alumin. Like what? Oh, dude. what a man! I wonder if he has a girlfriend. Hello. Drogo jug. Is that your name? Drogo jug. Am I not allowed in there? Drogo jug. But I need to be granted an audience with the king. Druggle Jug. Too bad. Oh, <laughs> okay, cards. What a guy. If only I could impress him somehow. Isn't Druggle Jug a fine specimen? Hmm. I'll admit that I'm a bit jealous. So. We still. Oh, did have a knife. Stab his ass. I could never harm him. Oh, what a man. I wonder if... No, the resident... Get your thirst in control, hen. Struggle jug! What? But I need to... Struggle jug. All right. I'll have to earn a little respect. <sighs> Slash on the sofa. Find pennies. Aye. <laughs> right. Okay. You. Hello. Hello, young lady. Wait. Stay there. There's no doubt. You're different from the others. Your aura is highly energetic. Who are you? Where do you come from? Pardon me, sorry. Bless you. Good day, I'm your cousin Betty from Australia. Not important just say normal things. No point in going along with it. I'm tempted to go through all the options, yes. but that will still make for Your <laughs> impulse for freedom is very strong. Your chi doesn't only flow, it gushes. You have been reprimanded far too often. You have been hindered far too long. The levees are about to break. The volcano is about to erupt. Wow, those are good guesses. What brings you here, Edna? Who lives in the Cushion Castle? That would be King Adrian. Quite an interesting case. He <laughs> got struck by lightning and developed certain abilities after that. In fact, his case supports some of my. Oh, it's theories. just been pee pee poo pee pee poo pee pee poo when he's talking. What exactly are those theories? I have developed a couple of theories regarding Adrian's case. After lightning struck him, he suddenly had psychic abilities. I don't know exactly how to name my theory. I'm considering psychokinetic conductivity through electric currents, electrostatic psi extension, high voltage precognition, or just Fortune doesn't always favor fools. What abilities are those? He sees things before they happen. Wow! No wonder he's your king! He must be very powerful then. Indeed he is. He always wins at Chinese checkers that way. Yeah, yeah, but in addition to that... And at Scrabble. But the possibilities! You said it. The recreation room is full of board games. And Adrian wins them all. 
He even won the jigsaw puzzle contest. The prize was a medal of real gold. Mm, so that's obviously. Mm. I'd like to get to him, but Drogglejug won't let me pass. Oh yes, Drogglejug is as unyielding as his appeal to the fairer sex is strong. <sighs> Don't get your hopes up. Women fall at his feet in droves. Perhaps it's that intellectual aura he radiates. He is very well read, our Casanova. And he's rather witty in conversation. But even though he might appear rough on the outside, he's very sensitive. How do I get past him? After the king has ordered him not to let anybody pass? Never. He is the most devoted soul I've ever known. He'd grant access only to the king or some higher authority. Yeah, well, bet you I'm an emperor's gonna fuck him away. Why do you call him king? Well, that was the wager in a game of Yahtzee. <laughs> we were naive enough to think we could beat him. B-Man had worked out a strategy. The ticket inspector developed a fail-safe system. Professor Nock supplied us with the medication. He had scraped together everything he could get his hands on for one whole year, just for the occasion. Petra even designed a special choreography for us to follow. Alas, it was to no avail. Well, we could have done worse. Imagine if Petra had won Pilates every morning. At least of a very, very, very nice bomb. Let's talk. Do you know a way outside and in like the two sides? I'm going to skip through this, guys, because this could go on for a while, but I want to get some kind of thing. Normally, so I'm just going to speed read it. But the coat hanger is it for one thing. It is my- I'm also keeping it handy, just an aluminum suit is very prone to wrinkling, you know. Who are you? My name ceased to- the moment I inherited- I decided to abandon- I am known as- You loonies love to refer to yourselves only by- It's just easier to memorize. Try that. I have to get- Take care. Rickety 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 Oh, there's a wee man. Hello. What the pest and fuck? No, thank you. I prefer to eat standing up. Ooh, don't eat the man. Or oh, did I try and knife him? Tempting, but I'm busy right now. Hello. Hey, you don't have to hide from me. How can I be sure? You could be a velociraptor in disguise. I'm Edna. I am Professor Nock. Pleased to meet you. What are you doing back there? I am doing research in the field of paleontology. Behind the armchair? Where else would I be? You won't find a prehistoric skeleton lying in the middle of the room. It would have been recovered a long time ago. That makes sense. Uh, yep, I make sense. May I please change the channel? By no means! I need to know how this ends. The fate of mankind depends on it. The dinosaurs become extinct. That can't be! They're just pretending to lull us into a false sense of security. I wonder what they're up to. Are they secretly planning to melt the polar ice caps? Hmm, you can change the channel. I need to make preparations. Okay. Do I want you to do that? Welcome to the Stock Exchange News. This is about two things and two things only. Buying and selling. Great. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. Got any of them game shares, bro? <laughs> Talk to me now, or? Hello? Hello? Wait. <laughs> Bye. What? 
What's that? Bye. 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 Wouldn't you recommend selling eventually? What do we do here? No. Bye. Bye. Everything. Bye. Bye. What's that? <sighs> that was close. This was the optimal moment, you say? <sighs> Luckily, I wasn't distracted. Unimaginable. Okay, um... Hello? Hello? Bye. W what's the... Bye. Bye? No! Stop by! What's that? <sighs> Hello? I know this... I don't know why, but I feel like there's something here. Ho hold on, do you want anything in particular? Can you get- Certainly not. That's my broker on the- We're talking. You don't- No, but, but you don't want to get out of here, believe me. The world outside, mistakes you make out there have real consequences. You could lose millions of dollars. Let's say, only because you were distracted for a tiny, a uh, little, tiny little moment. When your wife is shouting, look, Brucie, it's a boy, for example. That kind of guilt will haunt you for the rest of your life. Can I but Absolutely not. I don't dare think about what could happen. Just imagine me putting that thing when my wife is shouting, look, Brucie. Or worse still, imagine. During that brief, when I look over to my wife, my stock portfolio, I would lose because I had just for a tiny little instant, one moment, and my whole life. Not Hello? Hello? Ah. Bye. W what's that? Bye. Bye? Bye. Bye? Wouldn't you recommend selling eventually? Oh, this is kinda cruel. Look, Brucie, it's a boy! What? What? Just a joke. A joke? Oh no. Not again. The phone call! Hello? <sighs> you still there? What's that? What? Lost everything? Not again! <sighs> okay. I understand. Alright. Later. <sighs> Didn't you want to make a phone call? Here, you can keep the phone. <sighs> okay, but why did I want that phone that's not connected to anything? <laughs> Do you want a phone? It's just a phone. I don't want to have a phone. It's a phone call. Yeah? Hello? What? It's for you. Druggle Jug? Druggle Jug. And? Druggle Jug. Yeah, I find those annoying as well. <laughs> what? 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 place in my nightshirt, and the window seat in my heart belongs to Harvey. I spit on passers-by from up there! <laughs> Alright. Let's see what else we got. Aye, that's the best bee, man. There's a man, dressed like a bee. Can I have these? Give me them. Can I have these? Excuse me, I still need them. On. Would you like to make a phone call? 
Not necessary. We bees communicate by choreographed dancing patterns. Really? Maybe you can enlighten me. What's the deal with tap dancing? It is some kind of bee hip-hop. Aha! Oh, key. Hang on. Key. I just seen key. Right, give me. Give me. Take. It is very tempting. But this is exactly what such art is all about. The angrier I get at my own understanding of the need not to swipe the key, the deeper the genius of the work becomes. And the more I realize I can't take the key, the madder I get as a result. What? Fucking sure. Well, spoon. Give me. I need it. Okay, I just need the spoon. Hey, don't touch that. That's the only spoon I could find in the whole house. Hmm. <sighs> so glad for games that have this double click feature because I'm so impatient. Let's try these doors. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Surprise! Oops. Oops. Well... Who are you? I'm Petra! Give me a pay! Oh, uh, you know what? You can keep the pay. What are you doing here? What does it look like? For who? Where are the other guests? Hello! It's a surprise party! What kind of surprise would it be if everyone knew about it? G granted, I can't find a flaw. Yes. You didn't have to do that. The party is not for you. Today is the birthday of Peter! Oh. But please! Don't tell him the party is here! It's supposed to be a surprise! We'll see about that. You have to promise you won't tell him. Okay. Promise? Bet you have All a right. night. I promise. Swear it! I swear. You. Cross your heart! Okay, okay, I'll okay. You Cross your heart and hope to die! I swear it, okay? Okay. I'll take your word for it. I'm going to take that pen and I'm going to write dickhead on your eyeball. <laughs> it reminds me of uh, Rugrats, 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 Wee Blonde, the bully one. Uh, Angelica, maybe? It's Phil and Lil are the twins. Lil was the other. So it's Angelica. I'm sure it's Angelica. Somewhere. Interesting choice of venue. What do you mean? Don't you think more people would come if it wasn't in the bathroom of all places? I don't know. It is a surprise party after all. And what could possibly oh, be more surprising? Surprising doesn't do it justice. Appalling or absurd. That's more like it. Oh yeah. So, where would you have thrown the party? Cafeteria. Oh dear. How about the break room? Huh? No! We never go in there anymore. Free people vanished there once. They were actors. I think they were auditioning for a play. They were never seen again. How about the TV room? about the bar? That's out of the question. Peter's been sitting there all day long, crying into his drink. And it's supposed to be a surprise party. He's a little touchy when it comes to his age. I hope the party can Wait, cheer him up. 
Wait, wait. Any room would have been ah, not. <sighs> Keep on celebrating. Oh, oh, yeah. We'll see. So the bar was here. Probably should have spoken to these two, but talk to about it. Give me. Ooh, this is so 80s. I like cocktails. Why? I don't want to open an internet cafe. What'll I have? What? There's only the stinky drink. What is this? The choice is red, except for the stinky drink. Mm. Barkeep, one drink. I'll be with you in a minute. I'm... But he already has a drink. Don't tell me my job. Use Peter. I don't want him to feel any worse. Hey, you. I'm Edna. Who are you? Hi, Edna. I'm Peter. Really? What parents call their child Peter? <laughs> How old are you anyway? Nobody's named Peter nowadays. My, 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 my. What an exceptionally ugly name. I'd kill myself if I had a name like that. God fucking. Uh. I mean, it isn't that bad. The name might be ugly, but it becomes you in a way. Petra is having a surprise party for you in the bathroom. I know. Don't you want to go? I think she went out of her way to do it. Not even wild horses could drag me there. Why do you think I'm hiding here? Petra, with her constant high spirits, it's more annoying than a bag of crab legs. At least crab legs keep their mouths shut. Is there something wrong with you? Something wrong doesn't even begin to describe it. It's my 40th birthday today. Yet one more year, one more decade on the odometer. <sighs> my life really can't get much worse. You have a bipolar disorder, right? The doc calls it that. Yeah. And what do you call it? I call it Peter. Er, Peter. I could try to cheer you up a little. You might as well try. I don't see how that could make things worse. So, this man walks into the docks. Well, the man is approximately your age, so that's old. The doc says, Peter, you won't be around much longer. That wasn't the whole joke, was it? What joke? I only wanted to gently prepare you for what's coming soon. This is not exactly encouraging. <laughs> oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> right, that's it. That's great. <laughs> Your problems are completely irrelevant in a cosmological context. To be more precise, you are irrelevant from a cosmological standpoint. I mean, what good does your existence do to anybody? And who will care when you don't exist anymore? Have you ever done anything that will leave a lasting effect? What is there that will last anyway? <laughs> Nothing. Uh, Even the pyramids the will crumble and fall eventually. In the end, all is futile. And all you ever struggled for, oof, just hot air. What I'm trying to say is, uh, well, what exactly? You wanted to cheer me up. Oh, yeah, right. At least, you've got your health. Still, the decline will happen inevitably. You might as well be happy that at least the machine is still ticking away satisfactorily. Because that's what the body basically is. Not much more than a machine. And every machine ends up in a junkyard eventually. Of course, there's a long phase where you try to keep it running. A little fix here, a little repair there. But still, it, it's inevitable. It's better to not even try. No machine is designed to last forever. 
and you need to recognize the point where it's merely a nuisance to all. Hmm. I've lost a thread just now. What was I driving at? You wanted to cheer me up. Oh, yeah. Right. Sure. At least you're still alive. That doesn't go without saying at your age, you know? You're entering a phase in your life where the only way is down. The good times won't return. And you might as well forget about all the achievements you haven't made by now. You've missed that boat, Peter. From this point on, it's going to get permanently worse. Uh... I've lost the thread just now. What was I driving at? You wanted to cheer me up. Oh, yeah. Right. It's a beautiful day and the sun is shining. Well, okay. That doesn't help you a great deal in here. You are locked up in here after all. So you can't share in all the great activities people can do on the outside. But maybe it helps to bear in mind that everyone else is having fun. Because unlike you, they can do whatever they please. <laughs> and let's be honest here. They're probably happy that you're not with them. Right. You're... Uh... I've lost... You wanted to... Oh, yeah. I give you're simply too hard on Thanks for your help. Don't mention it. Uh Do you know a way There is no not out of this building. <laughs> I'd better Right. Why should You're right. I don't know either. I'd rather not. The barkeeper looks like he's ready to start throwing burning chainsaws any second now. He's an artiste. <laughs> he's an artiste. <sighs> so, right, I've got a guide open. And now it lets me take it. What? What's the difference? Is it because I spoke to him? <laughs> Alright. I opened up a no spoilers guide just to kind of speed this up and uh, I've been trying to follow it since I got the fucking bottom floor and talked to Mr. Meep. Uh, so by the back door. This is how vague this is. What was that? Nothing. Turning it now. Coin shirt. Change. Okay. I guess I just still have a phone. We can use it to bonk someone in the head with. No. No, that's what's our charge.
should have speak to B Man. I feel like I should have spoke to B Man. Hello, B Man. Hello, stranger woman. You can call me Edna. Pleased to meet you, Edna. Who's your little friend? That's Harvey. He's helping me to escape. Hi, Harvey. Cool, get up, buddy. Are you trying anything in particular? I'm still waiting for inspiration. A sip of coffee would surely be of help. Oh, but I'm ashamed that's why I wanted me to get the coffee. That's nothing to be ashamed of. My allergy leads to an overproduction of earwax. Oh. Ooh. I'll be going there. Go ahead. Poison. Here, I've brought you a cup of coffee. How considerate of you. I don't want to take it all at Wow. I keep up. Oh, oh, yeah. We'll see. Here's something for your buffet. <laughs> Animal protein. We only have vegan food at our party. No animal should ever have to suffer. Not even a stupid cow? Cows are not stupid. They are highly intelligent. A cow even beat me in chess once. Ooh. Wow. Keep on. Oh, oh yeah. We'll see. I wish there was a way to, like, cycle through. Do I need to leave and then come back in? Could you please do it yourself? I'm literally skipping through the guide now just to kind of get through some of this like I don't even think I'm at the halfway point of this I want to get to at least a certain point so I'm going to power through until that but this isn't a game you're meant to uh, like just jump, hop, skip through. You know, you're meant to talk to everyone, see every interaction. That's where the fun of the game is. But uh, as as a point and click, it's not very good for a stream as I thought it was. Like, cause the only reason I even played this is because I was going through lots of games that involve crazy little girls and asylums and all sorts. Um, I'm gonna finish this as videos, but for now. <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> Apparently, a depressing dude here wants some depth. I've got something for you. This will get you back on your feet in no time. I doubt that. <laughs> what? Or. I still have earwax, I didn't drink the ear. What happened there? Why was. Or was it just been sitting there for a long time or something? Right, whatever. I'll just try to logic why that was why that was where it is. Bucky, one drink, please. Of course, my dear. What will it be? Grog, coffee, water. Biggity buggity boo. One walkthrough. <laughs> I've already caught one of those. Ho ho ho. Because it took me half an hour to the first room. It's not the point. A Shut stinky up. stinky drink, please. One stinky drink coming up. That's cute. With a little umbrella. But what's that funky smell? Did somebody die suddenly? 
It's got all this stinky drink, my dude. Must be crazy. Are you all right? Edna, say something. The natives have surrounded the fort, Colonel. Phew, thank God. Everything back to normal. How was the drink? So so. Well, at least you finished it. Yes. I had to destroy it. Something as diabolical as this stinky drink should not roam free in the world. Besides, I didn't finish it completely. I left the fly. Ugh. I could press the fly into the earwax. That sounds good to my ears. So why don't we just do it? <laughs> it resembles a mosquito that's been enclosed in tree resin. Oh, uh, well, how were you ever meant to work that out? And more importantly, why did we need to? Oh, hi friends. I'd rather not disturb them. I'm sure they want to be left alone. I'd rather not. Why not? Oh, shut up, Harvey. That was bar. Um, toy. Nope, that's the school. We don't. We don't talk about that room. Where was the TV? The TV was out in this corridor. Thanks. Hey, yeah, Mr. Paleontology man. Oh, absolutely good. I've got something for you. I can't believe it! Dino DNA embedded in amber, like it should be! This is exactly what I need for my dino breeding program! <sighs> May I keep it? What will you give me in return? Hmm... Well, the only thing I can give you is my ticket for the laundry lift. After all, I no longer need to travel to my Peruvian amber mines. Do we have a deal? Done deal. This is supposed to be a ticket? That's just a coat hanger. Right. <laughs> um, I just want to get by the coat hanger, but like apparently I was closer to it than I thought. So I guess we'll see. Uh, stop. Let's speak to friends here. Hi there. Hi there. <laughs> he seems to be a little. <laughs> Hi there. Tickets, please. What's the problem with that? Uh, don't pay it. I've been yelling at him to stop being so nervous all the time. <laughs> but do you think he'll listen to me? <laughs> <laughs> Please keep the ticket control. Hi there. Ticket. Back off, Mike. I'll be going. Please. Wait, you go. I've got my ticket. And may I see it? Very well. That's a valid ticket, but it isn't your turn yet. Please stand in line and wait until your number comes up. What? You've got ticket number three, but number two is up next. Why, that's stupid. The system never fails. Oh, oh no, the, oh, the, the, the nice man with the... <coughs> Where are we? I bet he's getting number two. Excuse me, please. Yes, my child. You really need this coat hanger for your weather experiment? I've got one here that's at least as good. Aha. Uh -huh. And now you'd like to swap. That would be nifty. Well, if it makes you happy. Thank you. You're a real friend. I like that man. Fucking drawable joke. 
the end of bells take my fucking coat hanger up your pipe. I've got my ticket. And may I see it? Very well. You may pass. Okay. Okay. Oh no, I wanted to speak to the man. Alright, okay, I'll stay with the from the laundry have packed this pretty well. I'm not the laundry girl, you clown. Power usage seems to be within acceptable range. Hmm. They're using too much energy. It's like someone's leaving the light on all the time. Go oh, fake off. The guys from the laundry of Don't go. I'm here now. Oh. Right. Can I just save here? There's auto saves and all sorts. I'm gonna leave it there. This was a lot slower going than I thought it was. Okay, I've not quite this since like 2011, maybe, you know, so at least 10 years ago. I'm thoroughly enjoying myself, but there isn't really much to comment on as the whole thing is voiced and or, you know, there's just long periods of me going, <laughs> what? You know, so, um, I'll probably start putting some videos out of this until I've finished the game, but I'll do it in a bit more sizable chunks than, you know, this relatively large stream. Because then it's just interspersed silliness and I can get away with talking to all the people because, you know, they'll be, you can just skip through conversations that annoy you, I guess. Can I do that in a stream, can you? No, because then you're a time traveller or you're blacking out and should see a doctor. You know, one of the two. Oh, fart. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap this gene up. Is anybody even here? Where is my streamy thing? Uh, it's not this one. Is it this one? It's this one. Yeah, hello. There's four of you. Jesus Christ. Sorry, I must have bored the tits out of you. Anyway, well, um, thank you very much for watching this nonsense. I will continue it via video form throughout the next few weeks. Uh, probably take me best part of three or four videos and then after that I've been absolutely dying to play some kind of action based one so I'm maybe go back and play that black and white one or I'll just bite the bullet and play Bloodstained. Um, the reason I didn't want to play Bloodstained originally was because I can't resist grinding for stuff. If there is a way for me to get obscenely powerful for a move on, I will. Which means... Eh, whatever. You know, it doesn't matter too much. I just, it just made me realise that, hold on a minute, what I could just do instead is pause it so I can get the essential grinding out of the way, and then I'll just do a wee kind of highlights video. Mm. Eh, whatever. Do you know what? Wh whatever. Bye.